What's up, everyone? Wednesday. A little late today. Got busy. But wound up in a cool place. Down here in Long Beach on the boardwalk. It's not raining. Super pretty. And now we're going to get your message of dead before it gets too late. So uh, I was out showing houses. Um, a friend of mine's looking for houses, and we got down here to uh, Long Beach and we. I just looked at a bunch of houses and now uh, finishing up the night with a message here on the beach. Always awesome down here in Long Beach. Peaceful. Down here, a beach burger. And uh, message of the day. We're talking about boundaries. Boundaries. So, do you let people walk all over you? In many different ways. Um, relationships. People take advantage of you, they treat you wrong, they treat you right. Um, they make you uh, do things you don't want to do. Uh, do they, uh, what are you allowing to happen in your life that you don't want to do? Is it uh, relatives possibly that are uh, pushing you to do stuff you don't want to do, go places you don't want to go? Is it uh, work stuff, taking your time, stealing your time? Uh, maybe you're uh, off work personal time and Get stuck doing work that uh, shouldn't be doing at that time. Boundaries. So where do you set your boundaries, and do you set boundaries? Uh, there's a lot of talk about boundaries. Um, we need to control our space and our life and our mindset. And we need to set these boundaries to not let people steal our joy, to not let people steal our time, to not let people steal um, whatever it is that we hold close to us. A lot of times we uh, we give too much. Um, we go above and beyond for people that don't deserve to go above and beyond. And I don't talk about go giving, right? Give without expecting anything in return. But sometimes there's a limit. Sometimes you're doing too much. Sometimes you're sacrificing yourself too much uh, to please others, to help others. Uh, sometimes you're uh, tolerating people mistreating you in your life. Uh, maybe they're not. Uh, respecting your time, maybe you're not respecting your wishes, and you let them. So we need to set boundaries. When something's not going the way you want, when someone's stealing your time, when someone's stealing your joy, we need to put a wall up, we need to put a boundary up, we need to stop that. We need to allow them, uh, not allow them to do that anymore. Um, we are in control of our lives, and we are in control of our own destiny, and we are in control of our boundaries. So think about what's bothering you. And can you make it stop? Is it a situation? Is it a person? Is it people? Is it a job? Is it a relationship? What is it in your life that is uh, stealing your joy, stealing your time? We know we talked about the other day, time is the most precious commodity out there. Can't be bought, can't be replaced. So uh, when you don't have boundaries and let people steal your time, um, they're stealing a precious commodity. And you're letting it happen. Let it happen. So, Think about that. Think about what in your life you need to uh, put a boundary up. You need to keep a person from uh, taking advantage. Um, a lot of times we just want to be nice. We don't want to get into conflict. We allow things to happen that we don't want to happen. So uh, something to think about, setting boundaries. So here's your message today. Set your boundaries. Don't let people steal your joy. Don't let people steal your time. You are in charge of your own destiny. You are in charge of your own happiness. I don't let anyone else be in control of that. All right, so let's jump on prayers. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death, amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, please help us to uh, take control of our lives, help us to set boundaries, and not let uh, people sneak into our lives and take advantage of us. Help us to not uh, lose our joy, help us not lose our time, and help us to uh, know the difference between those people that are there to help us and those people there to hurt us. Amen. All right, today's your message. Set your boundaries. Set your boundaries. Boundaries are important. 
So one last look here at the surf, Long Beach, New York. Fun thing about being a real estate agent is I get to go to all kinds of cool places. So I have a client down here looking in Long Beach. We look at a couple properties down here, Long Beach, Oceanside, and these areas over here. And uh, yeah, that's the fun part of real estate. I get to meet cool people, get to go to cool places, um, and uh, I enjoy it. So if I can help you with any of your real estate needs, you know where to find me. Uh, those of you guys that saw, I just put up a Rockville Center listing, 1.2 million. It's a six bedroom, three bath, 3,000 square foot in Rockville Center. Uh, that'll be hitting the market as of coming soon tomorrow. And I just pulled up at West Hempstead. That one's pretty cool, 85 by 150 lot. That's a four bedroom, center all colonial, nine foot ceilings, custom molding work, uh, new roof, a uh, bunch of new stuff in the house, right by the Hempstead Country Club, Cathedral Gardens, West Hempstead. That is up for 699. A um, couple other things in the works. Oh, my Elmont listing. Uh, mother, daughter in Elmont. Buyer's getting cold feet on that one, so that one's going to be back on the market. We're trying to do another open house this weekend. So that is a beautiful high ranch mother, daughter um, in Elmont. That is up for $7.99. Um, we had an offer that was pretty close to uh, asking price, but um, did the home inspection. Everything went well. Everything was good. And the buyer just got cold feet, and they haven't signed the contracts yet. So we're going to do another open house. So... Uh, see what happens real estate life that's what happens um we keep going until it's uh until it's sold so anyway all right everyone have an awesome wednesday appreciate you all put your head on the pillow every night knowing you make the world a better place fire starts fire let's go how about that view how about that view awesome good night all